it was an interesting evolution for me uh, to try and define a role for myself as a scientist. I, I started working at SFU in 91. Clackwatt Sound, the summer protest was 93. I was a member of the scientific panel for sustainable forest practices in Clackwatt Sound from 93 to 95. I feel like my whole career has played out in the context of public discourse and disputes ab ab about the forests. And I really set a goal for myself to try and speak for what did we actually understand about, about forest ecosystems and give the same message to no matter who I was talking to, whether it was the forest industry or the government, environmental groups, First Nations, and try and speak for the science in a context where politics and economics and uh, social issues tend to dominate. Um, but there is a real role, there's a critical role for actually understanding the nature of the systems, the ecosystems we're talking about. What is possible? What can we do? What are the tools we have to try and achieve that? And I take great pride in generally having been seen as someone who you, you could trust what I said, you could trust I wasn't gonna go beyond the data, you could trust that I had reasons for any of the statements that I was making, and that I would give a fair hearing to anybody who wanted to talk to me, irrespective of their political perspective or their, their role in the debates. And so I've been fortunate enough to work closely with really amazing people in the forest industry, with fantastic committed environmental activists with phenomenal people in First Nations and some great people in government. There are, I mean, it's easy, it's, a, it's, a, it's an issue where it's easy to demonize the people on the other side. And there's a lot of that that's gone, uh, gone around. I have generally found that most people, most of the time are doing the best job they can given the information available. And there is a lot of opportunity to make change when everybody is interested in actually working together. And we've seen enormous changes from, from when I started in, in this business. We've seen enormous changes in the protected area system in the province. We've seen changes in forest policy and forest practices. And we've seen incredible changes in the recognition of the role of indigenous communities in being able to assert their authority over their traditional territories and, and, and play a critical role in determining what kind of trajectories their territories will be on.